Hello and welcome to the Woodland Weekly for December 20th, 2017, our final edition for the 2017 calendar year. Starting off this week with the board updates. So this past Monday, we held our regularly scheduled board meeting and Hancock uh, Wood Electric was on hand. Uh, what they were there for is they provided a donation to the Woodland School of $5,000, which will be used for a utilization of technology in the classroom. Uh, so we want to thank all of the representatives of Hancock Wood Electric Company. Uh, we thank you for the generous donation and we'll be certain to put that to good use. Uh, also at the board meeting this past week was the uh, approval of our capital plan. So in 2018, uh, we will be making some significant renovations to the industries building, uh, adding some bathroom space, uh, really looking at the utilization of our conference rooms, really focusing on accessibility as well as adding a few offices. Uh, that overall renovation plan will certainly help us with the growth that we are having in the Service and Support Administration Group. Uh, and then a huge thank you goes out to the members of People First of Wood County. So all members of People First were on hand and they uh, provided a presentation where they showed our board and everyone who was in attendance, all of the different legislative activities they have participated in this past year. It was really kind of an overwhelming participation when you looked at all of the different uh, activities they participated in, from uh, going down to the State House on multiple occasions, uh, meeting with uh, local politicians, uh, sharing their concerns when it comes to uh, transportation needs as well as other system improvements that are necessary. I uh, just want to send a huge thank you to any People First members who may be listening out there. Uh, I want to thank you for your leadership and look forward to seeing you soon. And then also at the board meeting uh, was the development of a maintenance and apprentice program. So we've been having conversations here at the board regarding how to address some of our needs here on campus and our own maintenance department came up with a concept in which they could uh, provide a training program for those who receive our services in the development of maintenance positions. So beginning up approximately March of 2018, we will be uh, creating a few positions in maintenance in which uh, the goal will be to teach them the skills of the trade, uh, give them a chance to learn all of about lawn, landscaping, uh, other uh, general labor aspects, and then progress uh, as we can uh, all the way through any aspects in the maintenance department. Uh, and then what we will do is uh, work with those individuals to market their skills and obtain employment uh, throughout other agencies here in Wood County. Uh, really looking forward to that and uh, hats off to our uh, maintenance department. Uh, I think that is a, a novel idea and we are really looking forward to that. Uh, other aspects that we certainly want to talk about is uh, uh, the retirement of our very own Donna Beam. Donna Beam is retiring at the end of this month after 38 and a half years of public service. Uh, Donna, we want to thank you for all of your uh, desire, dedication, and loyalty to the agency. Uh, you will certainly be missed, and we wish you the best in retirement. Uh, and then lastly, I uh, want to wish everyone out there a happy holidays. It has certainly been a very fast-paced, rewarding 2017. We look forward to having you back in 2018. Uh, so please enjoy the holidays, spend time with family, uh, and we look forward to seeing you in January. And we will leave you uh, with uh, pictures from the most recent visit from Santa Claus to the students of Woodlane School. It was uh, certainly a fun day and, uh, you know, really appreciate everything that the school does uh, and happy holidays.